Paulo Coelho once said that if you have a great dream, the whole universe will conspire to fulfill it. Now, I'm sure that we all had a great dream today, to listen to a great speech. And the universe answered through Vlad's speech. And what made Vlad's speech so great was that he created based on a personal story. Now, stories are the building stones of great speeches. And what makes stories so great are some key elements. And Vlad managed to check three of them. Now, Vlad, your story managed to create powerful images in our minds through your descriptive words, through your adjectives, so many adjectives. The night was moist. The air was white like the snow. In my mind, there was a movie rolling. Congratulations for that. Second key element, great stories create suspense. Now, I'm sure that you all wanted to know what was Vlad's epiphany, what was his wish, and he told us only after two and a half minutes. So we were eager to discover what his story is about. Great job, Vlad. The third main element of a great story is a key and powerful takeaway. And you had an inspirational conclusion, powerful one. Happiness is not around us, but within us. Now, Vlad, I know that, I'm sure you know that life is like riding a bicycle. In order to be in balance, you have to keep on moving. I want to know if you want to keep on moving and advance to your a higher level. I have three main suggestions that can make your story even better. Number one, use your space and use movement with purpose. Now, you did move on the stage, back and forth, left and right, but that's it. Show us some main scenes from your speech and then your story will come alive in front of us. Second, use vocal variety. It would have helped if I knew when you were the narrator of your speech and when you were the character of your speech and when you interpreted other characters of your speech. So vary your tone, like the sales guy and your friends. In vary your tone, your tonality, your rhythm, your volume, so that we can make a difference between all these characters. And number three, interact with the audience. Now the risk with a story is that you, lose, you might lose sight of the audience because you talk a lot about yourself. How can you do this? Ask questions. Ask us some questions like, do you have, have you ever had an epiphany? Do you, have you ever wanted a bike? Or use the magic word, you, a lot. <laughs> that way we will be involved in your speech. Now, to conclude, your story was great because you created powerful images, because it had suspense, and because it had a key takeaway. If you use the space and movement better, if you vary your voice, and if you involve us in your speech, then I'm sure your next story will be a true blockbuster in the minds of your listeners. Congratulations.